free range, right? I want These are some of the eggs that we have. We raise them right here on the farm with our Red Star chickens. Red Star is a medium bred chicken that is medium size and the egg to feed ratio is great. They can produce an egg every 18 to 22 hours. So they're very, very prolific layers. And they lay a medium to large brown egg. So at Rosas Farms, uh, we have been a certified organic farm for quite some time now. We're, we're one of Florida's first and only all grass-fed, all natural organic farm. We do free-range eggs. We, we raise all grass-fed wild boar, never ever antibiotics or hormones. Um, we raise the wild boar, did I say Yep, said wild boar, beef. Um, beef. Uh, Quail. And now we have a little farm market. We have a little Whole Foods market that's open to the public. Mm -hmm and people come to the market and we sell other farmers sustainable products trying to increase the awareness for artisan and family farmers. Do some very green initiatives with the Organic Chef, which is another leg of Rosa's Farm. Where are the jobs going to be in green? Everyone wants to, to jump on the green bandwagon, but the danger in that is cannonball into organics you jump over sustainability very often. You have to watch out. The, the area that there's going to be growth for as far as positions in, in this specific industry is going to be the people that can bring value and quality to the product and do and it in a sustainable manner. Because what we always advise companies when we do our eco consulting is for goodness sake if you've got something to say that you're doing that's a green initiative step up to the green microphone right. and say it. But just make sure that when you say it, that you're not going to shoot yourself in the foot because greenwashing is something that people don't forget very easily.